favorite car to drive is my mom's car because I feel like it's the perfect size for me. Like it's not too big, it's not too small. The handling of it's really nice. I feel like it's super easy to drive. It just feels so comfortable inside also. Regardless of what model, uh, you can do that especially on the wagon. I love the wagon, it's got a lot of room and then the windows down and then the roof also. It's the feeling that you get when you're in it. With the Mazda cars, I think they're super versatile. It can suit each person individually and sometimes even like your different moods. So I think regardless of age or like your personality or your mood, you can, you can drive the car because it will fit to you. It's commonality among all the Mazdas that I've driven in my dad and mom's garage is that understated elegance. Because if you see the aesthetic of our house, if you see the aesthetic of what, what I wear, I don't want to call attention to myself. And yet, at the same time, every little piece, every little line is well thought of. But it doesn't mean that it doesn't pack a punch. It's if you feel like just being incognito, if you feel like just being in yourself, they're all the same. It's nice and clean, and yet, if you feel like being spunky and funky and wild at the same time, it can also do that. It turns out that we individually like to drive to relax or to gather our thoughts or to be serene. That's something that's common for all of us. It doesn't mean to pretend to be anything. That's what the cars are. They just give you what you need and exactly what you want. And I just noticed it that we have a lot of masters now. No? In my lifetime, we didn't have that much one brand you know, at any given time. If I have to drive, I pick the Mazda. That's the first thing because it's easy to drive.